नहीं मुझे कुछ दिखाई नहीं दे रहा है ओके ओके ठीक है स्मेल्स लाइक वीड मैन स्मेल्स लाइक वीड स्मेल्स लाइक पेट्रोल मैन Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're joining me for the very first time today, then I'd like to introduce myself. My name is Zara. If you like what you see today, then please do push that subscribe button and become a part of our lovely family. So guys, in today's vlog, I will be showing you my most favorite perfumes. Seven most favorite perfumes. Okay? And these are perfumes that I just cannot do without. You will always find them in my perfume collection and I am obsessed with them. And now I understand the guys out there must be thinking oh phew, there's nothing in this vlog for us. Well, no, no, no. You're wrong. There is a lot in here for you guys because this vlog here will come in very handy if you ever want to buy the woman in your life a perfume. And trust me, the best way to impress a lady is to get her a bottle of fine perfume. So guys, I will show you my seven most favorite perfumes in order of preference and then I will bring my husband Saurabh Pandey in here and I'll blindfold him and make him rate these perfumes to see which one he thinks is the best. And he will rate these perfumes on a scale of 1 to 10, all seven of them. So, without further ado, let's get started. Starting with my most favorite and that is this one here. Miracle Miracle by Lancome. Oh my gosh. I have been using this perfume since it launched back in the year 2000. Actually my sister started using it and then I got so beiman that I stole it from her and I was like no no ha give me this bottle. It's mine now. I love it and blah 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 and bechari she gave it to me. She said chal theek hai. If you like it you have it. But this perfume oh my god miracle. It is a statement piece. You put this like just spray it on and walk out and I am telling you people will turn their heads as you pass by. Okay? Because it is that it's just intoxicating. It has a very oriental smell, okay? Um with undertones of musk and then there's a little bit of lychee. You know, it's just it's I, I cannot explain this heavenly heavenly smell of this perfume but um you must try it and if you're into oriental scents then miracle by lancome is what you should pick up for yourself so this one here is number 1 on my list miracle by lancome so at number 2 i have got two perfumes tied and oh my goodness this perfume guys I use it so much that I've run out of it. I don't have the bottle, both of them. But I do have the body lotion for it, okay? So the name of the perfume is Pleasures. Pleasures by Estee Lauder, okay? Pleasures by Estee Lauder. And um like I said there were two that are tied. The second one is Pleasures Intense by Estee Lauder. Okay? So both of these perfumes are by Estee Lauder and oh my gosh. I cannot even explain to you what this perfume does to me. Okay? It's like you know that that smell in the air right after you know um right after like a nice spring rain, you know, spring showers. And then you know how the whole air smells like flowers? It smells like jasmines and lilies and roses. This is exactly what this perfume smells like. It's it's, it's like I can't explain it, but it's almost like you've just kind of like walk right out of a a rose bush it's so good it's so amazing and it is not overpowering at least the pleasures pleasures by estee lauder is not at all overpowering it is quite subtle pleasures intense as the name suggests is a little stronger than just the regular pleasures this perfume has become such a big part of me and a part of my identity that my nephews they're just they're very young you know when somebody wearing the same perfume walks by them they're like oh my gosh she smells like musi so yeah perfumes have that power of, of of becoming a part of you a part of your identity and i am so very very proud to say that 
Pleasures by Estee Lauder has become a part of me. On to my number three pick, okay? And that is also a very beautiful scent. And I was actually introduced to the scent by my sister-in-law. And uh, when she was wearing it one day, and I was like, oh my goodness, this is awesome. What are you wearing? And she's like, it is Chloe. So Chloe, guys, look how beautiful the bottle is, first of all. And the fragrance is even more beautiful. It is so good. And now, how do I explain this? This is a floral, florally musky, with a touch of oriental spice. You know, I hope that's making sense to you guys. But it is something to die for, you know? And again, it's not overpowering. It's just nice and subtle, you know? It's like, if you walk by somebody, they'll definitely smell you and go, whoa, whoa, what was that, you know? And this is one that I definitely recommend if uh, you're looking out for something that's subtle, powdery, feminine, you know? So Chloe is the perfume you want to go for. And that was number three on my list. Okay, so moving on to number four. This is a perfume I wear um, sometimes to the gym, you know, or on those days where I kind of feel a little playful and, uh, you know, not, like, not too serious. So for that, I use Versace Yellow Diamond. This is an amazing scent, guys. It is so light and this is like, like when I put it on, I feel happy for some strange reason. It's like, you know, I have it on and it'll just kind of, you know, like perk up my mood. And Yellow Diamond by Versace is kind of citrusy, as you can tell, you know, by the color. It's got that lemony, fresh scent, fresh smell to it. And I swear to you, when you put it on, it's like it just kind of wakes you up. So if that's the kind of fragrance that interests you, then Versace Yellow Diamond is what you should invest in. Okay, this one here, I don't really wear uh, during the day. It's more like when I have to go out for the evening and I want to feel sexy, you know, and I want to make a statement. That is when I bring out this baby. Very Estee by Estee Lauder. Guys, this fragrance here has a very floral, woody, yet musky smell to it. Okay, it's, oh my gosh, I just have it on right now. It's it's mesmerizing. But it's not really something that I would probably wear during the day. You know, it's one of those evening scents where you, you know, you, you feel that you need to make a point and you need to stand out. So this, my dear friends, Very Estee by Estee Lauder is what you should pick up. Now moving on to my next pick, number six, and that is Fifth Avenue by Elizabeth Arden. Guys, I have been using this perfume since I was, I think, a teenager, okay? And I always have a bottle of this in my collection. And as you can tell, you know, there's not much left. This is a classic scent, guys, classic, okay? And I think all the perfumes by Elizabeth Arden are classic scents. But Fifth Avenue, there is something to this. See, it's not, um, it's strong, definitely strong. Like when you wear this, you feel like a boss lady. Number seven on my list is this baby. Yes, this is J'adore by Christian Dior. Guys, this is an amazing fragrance. It's feminine, floral, with a little bit of muskiness, very refreshing. This is something I'd probably wear to the office uh, for a meeting. You know, it's, it gives you that, that feeling of empowerment. And this is what I call a boss lady perfume. So I highly recommend J'adore by Christian Dior if you are a boss lady. So guys, here is my list of favorite perfumes in order of preference. And now let's see what Sodom's list will look like. Okay guys, now that you have taken a look at my perfume collection, my favorite perfumes, now we're gonna call my husband in and we're going to get his verdict and his reviews on these perfumes. So Saurabh, come on in. Ta -da! Oh, wow. <laughs> that was quick. I appeared like this, like a genie. Yes, you did. Okay, so now you know you know what the game plan is, right? Yeah, yeah I know. Uh, my eyes will be yes. And then I will have to uh, smell these awesome, awesome perfume of yours. Uh, yes, and then you have to tell me which 
out of 10 you have to rate these perfumes okay i think i like your body perfume okay Let's see. <laughs> okay so i'm going to put this around your eyes okay. so no cheating okay 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 and shall we start yes let's okay. go nahi mujhe kuch dikhai nahi de raha hai okay okay theek hai to ab aaram se baitho okay okay so my darling viewers this is the first one okay that i'm going to be um giving him a whiff of okay sort of sit still okay and i have coffee beans and everything here for you so don't worry okay so i want you to tell me if you were to rate this perfume on a scale of 1 to 10 mm -hmm. what would you rate it okay mm. does it remind you of anything oh yeah you <laughs> reminds you i think i'll go for this like uh, eight to uh, 9 8 or 9 eight and a half Are you sure take another one eight and a half eight and a half okay i'm just going to write that down here here is eight and a half for this would you like some coffee beans sir yes my dear okay here you go okay neutralized neutralized no smelling <laughs> okay so the next one here sort of i don't have um the perfume of it because i ran out of it and you have to buy me a uh, new bottles okay so i've got the lotion i'm going to put the lotion on this mm. and then you decide or okay. i can put the lotion on my skin you decide yeah okay on my skin or on skin, the skin skin i okay. love skin okay there buddy okay now this blend this into my skin Give me the skin, baby. I don't think this is gonna. It's not. It's not the same as the. This is cream. Give me the skin, baby. No, it's gonna. Oh my god. Okay. Just. Hmm. What is it? Does it remind you of anything? Ah, uh, four. Four. Well, three actually. Three. Ah, uh, two actually. Decide. Two. Two. Okay. Yeah, I think the lotion just spoils it. Yes, but doesn't it remind you of something that Yeah, but I think uh it's kind of old right now. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're good. I, th I think uh, uh, after you close your eyes, yes. you know, your other senses heighten. Yes, they do. I can I can feel that. Okay, so now, my dear viewers, we're going for this one. Okay? Hmm, 7. Seven. Hmm. Okay. So that one here is a seven. Now I shall spray it. Do you need some coffee beans? Yes. Okay. Right here. Hmm. I'm here. <laughs> smells like weed, man. <laughs> What the coffee smells like weed? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, let's here. go ahead. Hmm. Quite fresh. Um. Uh, mm hmm. Mm like uh, quite quite fresh yeah it makes you feel very oceanic kind of fragrance mm, it's good uh, i think 8 uh, okay yeah 8 so this one is an 8 it's this one okay and i shall give you your coffee beans okay, <laughs> okay. neutralize my senses neutralize your senses now get ready for an attack Let's go. <laughs> It smells like petrol, man. Oh my god. <laughs> I think like, your nose is screwed. No, no. This smell This smells like mitti tel ke saath mix ho raha hai kuch. Mitti ke tel mein. Yeah, it smells like that. I'm sorry, but that's what it reminds me of with some pleasant smell for sure, but Yeah, now it's kind of okay. Yeah, I think five. Five? Yeah, five. I don't smell anything. I just think you need to sniff this a little longer. The okay. coffee beans. Mm. Probably <laughs> coffee <laughs> beans is like spoiling my sense of smell. Yeah. <laughs> it's quite pungent. And there's not coffee beans. There's like <laughs> just, grounded. It's actually, actually coffee. Instant mix coffee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, yeah. moving on to the next one. Okay. Here it goes. Ready? 
Yes, I'm ready. I'm looking through the telescope. Let it, let it air, air it out a bit. Seven. Seven? Yes. Okay. Last one, which is this one, guys. Don't give me coffee, but it's probably spoiling my sense of smell. I think so too. Yeah, smells of uh, coffee and then clove. Yeah. Because earlier in that thing, there was clove. Yeah. Okay. Okay, the last one. Uh huh. The last question. Okay. You ready? Hmm. I can say nine. Nine? Okay, so. Nine it is. Okay, you can now uh, take off your... Okay. Huh. So this is... Uh, Back to my eyes. <laughs> yes, how does it feel? Yeah, it feels uh, I missed something for a long time. Bottle is also amazing. Yeah. It's like a you know, genie in the bottle. Exactly. <laughs> that okay. <kind> of... <laughs> so for you, Jador was number one? Jador! Can you hold up Jador? Yes, madam. Jador was number one. Miracle was number two. This is Miracle. Yeah. Very Este was number three. Okay. Versace was number four. And Fifth Avenue was number five. These two were tied. Oh, okay. Yeah. Tied. Yeah, yes. This came in at <laughs> <The> lotion. <last. laughs> at last. And this was my second. So, ladies and gentlemen, this was our My Hubby Rates My Perfume, perfume. Collection. Okay. And as you can see, we have totally, totally different um, pasand when it comes to perfume. Well, I was honest at least. Yes, ours actually was Ulta. What I liked yours was exactly the other way around, almost. But anyway, this concludes our vlog and I do hope you all enjoyed this little experiment and do not forget to press that subscribe button if you haven't already and... Like, share and subscribe. Yes, please. <laughs> See okay. you again next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.